Kumo Sapiens is one of the leading technology providers that specializes in the digitalization of traditional business models in the insurance industry. They support insurers in successfully realizing innovative ideas and projects based on modern web and cloud technologies that fit in a rapidly changing market environment. Today they will present together with Nexable how they launched the digital insurer and made insurance feel simple. Next on stage, Sunkumo Sapiens. Hi everyone, my name is Valentina Brebenaru. I'm the Chief Technology Officer from Nexible, the insurance company. And today on stage I have with me Lucas Verle. He's the unit director from Zoom Kumo Sapiens. What we will talk about today is actually our new innovative travel product. Some of you might use it already, some of you might heard of it. It's actually based on our customer most uh, identified need from our side, which is high flexibility. And in order to achieve that, we actually had the same request to our technology partner. We needed high flexibility. Because the aim at Nexible is actually to launch fast new products, but also learn from new markets. And we believe that the travel product is a suitable one also for new markets. I mean, we launched two new products now into the into new, two new insurance worlds, so to say, into the travel and into the health world. They are two different markets with two different expectations, different expectations. But our target is also to leverage the knowledge which we got now into the German market and scale up to new countries. So this year, we actually launched Travel Austria and currently already working on launching our new market there. Um, we believe that the travel product is actually the best one to do so to start off with, because we can leverage the knowledge which we gain now from Ergo as a group and their insight in those markets. And we also solve the technology challenge which we have into shifting into new markets together with our partner Sumkumo Sapiens. Lucas, maybe you'd like to give everyone some insights into how, what those challenges actually were and how we were able to solve them. Sure, thank you. So let's stay in the topic traveling for a bit. We all booked flights before. What are we looking for if we book a flight? Should be a non-stop flight? You want to get there fast? Should be a flexible tickets if plans change? And also, you want to connect at your destination. Looking at the technical platforms which insurers are looking for, you have similar uh, challenges or at least uh, criteria you need. You want to be fast. You want to be flexible so that you can adapt if you change your products, if you want to scale up. And also, you have to integrate into systems, be it a core system, a payment system, or be it a tracking marketing tools. Also, obviously, last but not least, you always have to stay within budget. So Nexible, they have found their partner for their mission to um, expand products and markets. And that's our e-commerce suite, Skip Sales. It's a low no-code platform, um, which is attached to the core system. And um, as, as you heard in the intro, our mission is to make insurance feel simple. And let's dive into the demo. I want to show you how we can expand to another market. So what you can see here, it's the front end of Nexible. Uh, Valentina said so, Germany, Austria is live already. It's a very, very straightforward, simple sales journey. You can see it's quite, um, we've got different tariff modules, so the product can be tailored to our needs. Um, this is in real time, it was me being very pushy with, uh, with closing the product. You can add um, all the details, which is obviously needed, and you get a short summary. For uh, um, legal reasons, um, you can only proceed after downloading all your documents so that you're on the safe side. And very last but not least, I add my bank details. And now we're talking to the core system of Ergo. Feedback is here. So right now, I just got my uh, confirmation within my mailbox. That's what the customer sees. Let's see what Nexable and Ergo see. That's our product skip sales. And you can see the product is being defined here. So you can set every attribute. You can set different tariffs, different modules. It's all been done here. But we don't want to talk about just configuring the product. We want to talk about going to new markets. So here you can see I had Travel Germany. 
I ended to change it to Terrell expansion. And at the bottom in the menu, I can add a new language. Um, because it's the weekend coming up for the reason, I will go with Italy. And you can see um, I can also add documents. So obviously, if I go to another market, I need to have the conditions uh, in Italian, maybe there are some specifics. And also, a policy document can be rendered right from our software. So what have you got now? We've got an Italian variant, and we add our document. Obviously, um, we won't sell any product if it's like in German. So I switched to our sales front end, it's the journey creator. And you've just seen this one in real time, or in real life. Um, you can see it here again. So you can change everything, you can change steps, you can change every attribute. And as we want to go to the Italian market, um, I go for some Italian was translated with um, <laughs> DeepL, so apologies in case um, if anyone's here. And um, for yes, no, I add a C, no. And I can do this very easily with every step. So all you see here, it's done by the product manager of the insurer. It's not done by development or by ourselves. Very last but not least, maybe the product um, needs something else um, to work for the Italian market. Um, our latest addition to our product is the theme designer. You can see it here. I'm changing to the Italian one we just added. It takes a minute to load, or maybe seconds. And you can see here I've got a sales front end. So we can either use um, custom, custom uh, front ends from the insurer, or we can build one ourselves. Um, UX department will love me for using bright yellow in front of a white screen. And you can see I can do all changes to the theme. How many radio buttons do I want? Should they be sharp or, or should they be round? So with this one, it's quite easy to adapt your needs um, to, to a corporate theme or maybe to a broker theme, which you can use um, to have it designed. Um, we talked about Italy, so maybe we have to change the colors that they fit quite well with the Italian markets. And obviously, I'm going for the very nice red and green to make it look more, more better for the Italian market. So that was our very short demo. What have we just seen? So at first, we changed the product. We can create a new product, or we can do adaption for different markets, different uh, target markets. Next step, what we did, we went into the sales journey. Maybe if you want to have like, um, less steps for the Italian market, you could do so. Also, the product manager of Insurer, they can just change all the language, all translations from themselves. And at the very end, uh, you've seen our preview of our theme designer, which can be used, be it if you have a different brand in a different market, or if you have like a corporation partner and he says, like, oh, I want your same insurance, but it has to be in blue again. Um, all those things before they had to be done like by development. We are really enabling the insurer to all those bits to do all those bits themselves. So at the end, it's only a low effort for coding uh, to connect to the core system or to do um, the coding there. So um, what are plans for the future, Valentina? I mean, basically, we want to continue leveraging our existing products and also increase sales by going to new markets. Um, and we have a lot of insights which we are collecting and using within Nexible and also in the group level, in the Ergo group. And for the, from that perspective, I think the next market where we want to go to will be a surprise. So I hope we don't disappoint our Italian guests here. But it will not be Italy, it will be a surprise. Um, and if you'd like to follow us and see how our product owners can actually do the market separation and the product definition within the platform directly, please do so. Thank you very much for your attention. Thanks so much. Thank you.